So let's talk about improper fractions to mixed numbers. So this can be really confusing for students. So the easiest thing I can talk about is we've talked about how many pieces you color over how many pieces the circle is cut into. So I'm going to start by cutting this circle into four pieces. And then I'm going to color. I need to color nine. So we'll see that when I go to color, while I need to color nine, I can only color four. So I need to cut another circle into four pieces. And again, I'm coloring until I get to nine. So now I'm at eight. So again, I don't have enough pieces. So I have to cut another circle. And if I color one more, now I'm at nine colored pieces. So in order to get nine colored pieces, I had to color two full circles and one piece out of four in the remaining circle. So if your students are struggling with improper fractions, this might be a visual to them to help them understand how many whole circles you have and then what's left over in parts of a circle.